Hey guys, happy quarantine. <laughs> okay, just kidding, that's really ridiculous. I'm now on day five of quarantine and I am now just doing makeup videos in my bedroom to get away from my wild family. You may be able to hear my daughter running around. It's great, the screaming and the yelling is awesome. Anyway, uh, this is a little dramatic for me. I don't normally do, um, my eyes this bold but um you know figured why not look good to go sit on my couch right okay anyway just kidding um but real talk I got a little stoned um and decided to do my makeup in my bedroom just to uh stay away from the chaos but yeah so this is kind of what I did if you like it stick around and watch if you don't feel free to exit I'm gonna use uh a couple different primers. Uh, this one I'm going to use around my T-zone um, and I'm also using the Tati Beauty Sponge. Um, and then I'm just going to also use the Tarte Base Tape Hydrating Primer and I'm going to use that on the rest of my face because my face is a little dry. Hmm, it smells really nice. I don't normally wear foundation, so I'm actually not going to put any on. Anyway, I'm going to use this Pretty Vulgar concealer. This is Undercover 60 Little White Lies. That's the color it is. So, I don't know why I'm even bothering putting makeup on, because... I'm going to do an awful lot of, you know, walking to my couch and watching Netflix. It's going to be a good time. Quarantine's great. Anyway, I'm using a different corner of my Blendiful. This is like my first real time using this. So far, I think I like it. All right, so I'm also going to use my Born This Way concealer in Fairest. Um, yeah. Anyway, back to what I was saying. So I don't even know why I'm bothering putting makeup on because I'm not going anywhere. But I figured if I'm going to be stuck in my house, I might as well look good, right? Maybe I'll take some, like, pictures or something. I can get dressed up and go nowhere. I have a fashion show. It would be great. I have a cat in my bedroom. And I can hear him getting into something. I don't know. It's probably a plastic bag. They're always chewing plastic bags. It's so annoying. Yep. And there it is. All right, back again, another concealer. Um, yeah, I use three different colors, three different purposes. It's fine, don't judge me. Um, this is Maybelline Fit Me, number 15, lighter, light, just light, yes. Anyway, this is one I like to use. Um, anyway, back to what I was saying. Maybelline Fit Me. Um, this color I like to use on my chin and forehead because it's more of my skin tone. So it's more like foundation, but not foundation. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. All right. I am going to set my under eyes. Um, what is this? Oh, Cover Effects Setting Powder. Ooh. All right, well, this packs on some powder. Ta 
Crafty Beauty. I like this. This is a good product. Okay. Anyway. Now that I set my under eyes, um, I like to go in with a powder foundation. Um, this one's a Smashbox Halo in uh, Fair Light. I kind of like this because you actually turn this little knob and it gives you like the powder, like freshly ground powder. I don't know, it's fun. Time for bronzer. Uh, this butter bronzer is my favorite. I use the original bronzer color. Um, as you can see, it's my favorite. And then I also like this angled brush, Morphe uh, E4 brush. Bronzer is my favorite. And once I get done bronzing, sometimes I will use um, more of an ashier, like contour color, just to carve out my cheeks a little more. Now I'm taking taking my um, Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Finish Powder under my eyes to brighten me up a little bit. I think I'm going to use a little bit of two blushes because why not? <laughs> um, so this is the Cat Fondi Lolita. It's an eyeshadow and blush. I like it for blush because I would never wear this color on my eyes. And why not add a little hourglass diffused heat? Why not? So highlighter and blush in one, right? Anastasia Amrezy highlighter. It's one of my favorites. Now that the fun's over the face, let's do something with my eyes. This is uh, Palm Spring Dreams Too Faced. And these are the colors. So, hmm, it smells pretty good. Let's see if I can do it this way. So, this one I'm going to, what is this called? Cabana Time. I'm going to put Cabana Time all over my lid. She's lit all over the crease. So we're gonna take mocktail, why not? Take some mocktail and put that right in the crease. Nice and tight. Do BYOB and the outer corners and really deep in that crease. Taking my Tarte Amazonian Clay, right? Clay Play Palette. 
and using the color solstice out of it this white color right there we're gonna take that and highlight the brow bone Next, we're going to use the color Last Call, this one right here. And I'm just applying it all over my lid with like a dense dome brush M333. Then I'm going to use this one. I don't know, TFTI. Oh, it's another gold chrome shade. And I'm just going to apply that all over. And kind of just push it into the crease. All right, I'm going to go back to my Tati sponge and just kind of clean up underneath my eye. And I'm just going to mirror the lower lash line with the colors I used on top. And I always take a clean dome brush and blend all of that out. And again with my dense dome brush and we're just going to push that along the upper lash line. Now we're just going to add some liner. And time for brows. Now that that's done, time for mascara. I like to use two different kinds. It's just the way I am. Time for lips. I think what I'm going to do, this might be perfect. This is Aftermath, uh, Dose of Colors Aftermath, the Desi and Katie collab. I um, might try that. I don't know. Let's see first. I also have this LA Girl Intense Stay Liner. Don't know. Oh, keep it spicy. I don't know. This. This color might be okay too. Ooh. Yeah, let's see. Maybe the two of them might go together. All right, guys, well, this is the final look. Not that I'm going anywhere, but um, yeah, kind of happy with how it turned out. I don't normally do like super dramatic color like this, but um, I figured why not just blend my life away and see how it goes. So yeah, um, I don't know, don't really have anything to talk about. hear my family screaming um, yeah so this is basically it <laughs>